Testing one, two, three. Uno, dos, tres. <laughs> the dudes, the doo dudes, they made it. That is quite the delay. Sounds good to me. Welcome everybody to round three of our Borderlands 2 cycle run. <coughs> they grow up so fast already on to the third round. Uh, oh man. <clears throat> Hopefully this time we make a lot more progress than what we did in round two. Because that was just... That wasn't... I didn't feel like we made that much progress last time. So we're going to start things off strong here by uh, moving our skills. Um, did not like Hellborn too much. But that's honestly because, you know, we didn't get... We don't have much of the fun ability yet. So we'll try Hellborn again later, maybe True Vault Hunter mode. Uh, I really do love Hellborn, it's a really good skill tree, just way too early to use it. On the other hand though, let's see what we got to work with here. Could go to Bloodlust and mess around with Bloodlust. Uh, don't think weapon swap speed is that important for the first run. I mean, I could get magazine size and just read my way through. Increase my buzzsaw rampage. Uh, killing enemy with a bullet increases your melee damage. It reduces grenade fuse time for each stack of bloodlust. That's not bad. Not bad at all. We're just going to go down to Mania Tree. Hmm... We'll do that. And we'll do this for now. Switch them out. And what do we got to do? I can turn in Mighty Morphin. Yeah, I'll turn in Mighty Morphin and we'll finish a train to catch. Let's do this cycle, yeah. me and you. Ooh, we got one point left. Uh, this hurts my brain. This could be useful. We'll go into this. To the people who are watching, does it sound okay? Sound good? Sound bad? Oh, fuck you, Varkid. Who the hell is Mushy Snuggle by? 
Gotta save the Badonka Donks! I'm coming for you, Badonka Donks! Who's shooting me? Everyone's shooting me. No! No! It's burning! Oh, this might be death, actually. God damn it! No! We just started and I already have one death on me. It's been been a little while since I last played Psycho. I've been mostly playing the Assassin. Assassin and Gunzerker. Uh, gotta get to the swing of things here. Let's swing in our buzzsaw, or in this case, our shotgun. Because our shotgun has a blade. And we can do this to people. Oh my goodness. Why is everything doing so much damage? Burn, killer marauder. Just these damn buzzards too. They do so much damage to me. It's not fair. It's not fair. <laughs> uh, that was terrible. That looked that looked like it would have been cool. Buzzard, please! Buzzard, please! Buzzards, why? Buzzards, why? Now you're not even gonna let me kill you! Shotgun! Shotgun, please! No! These damn buzzards! Oh, I hate them so much! Buzzards, why? If I was the siren, you'd be dead a thousand times over. I like how I like how the robot gun, my shotgun, is still talking to me even though I'm not using the shotgun anymore. <laughs> it's like it's my pistol that's talking to me. Like, Pistol, please. It's okay. You're not a shotgun anymore. You don't have to talk to me anymore. Oh, no, it's my shotgun. I thought he was my shield for a second. Why is he still talking to me? Yes. Shoot once. Um, terribly missed that grenade. Ready? 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 Boom! Why is he still talking to me? Is that what he does? Does he still continue to talk as long as you have him equipped? I thought it was only when you were actually using the shotgun portion. Oh, I never knew that. I'm actually wearing headphones. I wear headphones when I stream these uh, streams so that way I can hear the, you know, the sound of the game. And y'all don't hear it twice through the microphone. And I never realized he did that. Do it, Tiny Tina. Let's do it. Got a. Got that far, kids. How does that make you feel? Oh, 
question is, should I switch to a better shield? Mm, the cycle's not really that big on using shields. And because of the delay on, uh, because of the shield delay I have. I can't believe I actually survived that. Uh, because of shield delay, this shield I have will be a lot more useful. Hmm, I don't know if I should switch to a better shield or not. Pro I'll probably keep this one for now until I get a uh, roid shield. Get some roids in here. Get that roid damage. Tina, I'm back! Uh, don't want this anymore. Uh, this is not a bad, this is not a bad weapon, but I don't find it useful for the upcoming parts. Don't need to be toast anymore. I wonder if they actually animate Tina to do something in there. Probably not. They probably just make her stand there. Yes, ma'am. Now the question is, should I do this quest? Uh, the, you know what? I think I'll get the teapot, just in case. Either that, we got a chance for the baby maker. Sure, why not? We'll go for the teapot. Boom! 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 So six booms before it recharges. Good to know. Hi, Var kid. Crosshairs, baby. You're gonna stand there and take that? You're just gonna stand there and take that? Get out of here. Ain't got no time for you. Oh, it's Var Kids. Look at all the baby Var Kids. Look at them. Oh, that one's trying to turn into an adult. Too bad we won't let it. Oh, this one's trying to turn to an adult, too. Ooh, I actually leveled up off that. Nice. Mm, there's a lot of good skills in this freaking tree. I don't really know if I'm going to be doing a lot of overkill. Probably. Because... I, I do get a lot of damage in this tree. Uh, sure, we'll try some overkill, see how much overkill I get. See, it, it, I did 434 damage to that Vara kid, but I don't know how much overkill that would be. I don't know their exact health. I don't know, maybe, maybe this uh, uncanny peril will give me a lot of, a lot of overkill, or just my raw melee power, or just everything that co is combined together. I can't, I really never noticed that the robot gun actually talked to you the entire time. That is news to me. Please excuse Madame Bond Bartle's 
I mean, I could get a lot of health back with the uh, fastball if I don't miss. Where the hell are you going, Madam Von Barsley? Is there a baby maker here? Baby maker? No baby maker. And only an Aegis. You didn't drop a baby maker. I guess I gotta go get the developer's chest then. Cause I got screwed, man. I didn't get no. I didn't get no baby maker. He didn't drop it. So sad. So sad. This is. Ah, oh, that's a poopy. I think that's a poopy Vlad off rifle. A snipper. It doesn't have the barrel everyone uses on Vlad off rifles. I don't even. This is a Molly Wong barrel. It might be a Molly Wong barrel. Whoa, 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 whoa. What about this? Uh, another Malawan barrel, I believe? Might be. It's glowing. I don't know what that uh, stock is. Yeah, that could be an X. And then... A train. I just realized we got to go and pick him up. <sighs> I was so... I was so interested on seeing if I got a baby maker. I didn't even check to see if I. <laughs> I didn't even check to see if I picked him up or not. Oh, shortcut, please. No. Shortcut. Oh, do I have to go all around? No, it's it's not my fault. It's Madame Von Bardley's fault. She didn't drop a baby maker. She made this entirely pointless. there up the mountain good shot Mordecai can you please not kill them though before I get uh before I get this guy before I get Sir Reginald there he is will do screw these buzzards Alright, any other buzzers that want to fight? I mean, I'm ready. I got me a freaking corrosive anarchist. You guys are doomed. I even got me freaking shock fastballs. Is that it? No. Oh. oh, there's another buzzard. I hear it. Hi, buzzard. Yeah, get out of here, buzzard. Flee for your life. <laughs> oh man, one landed up there. That's so sad. Uh, wait for him to come back around. Nope. He's just gonna die over there. Okay. That should be enough. Destroy him for good measure. Uh, grab the crumpet. More ammo! Woo! <laughs> I love, I love the fastballs. Easily one of my favorite grenades. Mods. What's this? What is this? A fox? No one wants Fox. No one wants their news. No one wants their news from Fox. Get out of here, Fox. Fox McCloud. We don't want you to be freaking flying over us doing barrel rolls. Money! Hopefully. Hmm. 
<clears throat> Excuse me. Let's go find Flesh Dick! Flesh Dick! killed him that's not my fault tiny Tina I'm just too strong just too strong everyone gets set on fire everyone gets set on fire you get set on fire you are probably going to kill me so I'm gonna get over here and set you on fire never mind it ran out uh, can you please stop strafing back and forth like oh my god God damn it, you assholes. Okay, well. We accidentally killed Flesh Dig because I was blowing up the world with fiery explosions. Uh, bright side is that everything's dead, including our boy Flesh Dig, which is, uh, didn't want him dead. I'll teabag him anyway. Right, what do we got? Mm, none of this is as good as the freaking fastball. But oh well. Tiny Tina, I'm so sorry. I was just, I was blowing up the world with fiery explosions and I was just having so much fun and I'm so sorry. So, so sorry. What was this even relic? That was, ooh. Ooh, got some melee damage here. Since I'm going, ah, fuck that, I want to drive. We are doing a uh, melee build for now uh, because it's probably the best time to do the melee build. It's a lot of fun. Uh, I might do full melee Krieg. Uh, I'm going to try a lot of different builds with him as we progress, especially in Ultimate Vault Hunter mode or maybe even True Vault Hunter mode. Hopefully around level 50 or even when we get him to 72, we'll be able to... Uh, will be ooh I should probably take off the shield don't accidentally want to burn him but yeah I want to be doing all kinds of different builds on this guy it's not just going to be a hundred percent I don't want to melee him I might I might do too much damage uh, flesh stick I want to hear you scream I want to hear you scream. Here, Fleshy. Here, Fleshy. Here, Fleshy. Come here, boy. Here, boy. Ooh, don't kill me, please. Don't kill me, because I'll be forced to kill you. And please keep chasing me. Fleshy, you do way too much damage. Here, boy. Here, boy. There you go. 
Um, I believe if you shoot near his feet, you don't have to directly hit him. He will follow you, or you'll aggro him if you shoot near his feet. But I could be wrong about that. Uh, I want that boom! Give me the boom! Dude. Dude, screw, screw this uncamp herald. We got a boom. We're gonna go boosha boom somebody. Boosha boom! Uh, we'll do it like this. And, uh. <laughs> We got boom! 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 You go boom! You go boom! You go boom! Y'all go boom! And then you get melee to death. This one's mine. Oh. You can't stop me. Please continue to greet Flesh Dick's friends in the manner to which you are accustomed. Oh, what do we got? We got uh, Elite Marauder. Who went boom? More Elite Marauders. You go boom. You go boom. Uh, get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Be gone, you thieves and bandits. Said, be gone! Leave us alone as he comes charging at me. Oh, the midget lived. That's surprising. Now he's dead. My pets have pets. Two for one. Got a two for one deal on dead lives with a baseball or a snowball. I guess it's a snowball in the uh, in the pre sequel, but I like to think it's a snowball I throw sometimes just because it's a lot more fun. Get out of here, you badass! Did you live? No, you transform. You transform, I'll transform, and we'll fight each other. What's this? More toast. Got more toast, guys. Got more toast. I'm the conductor of the poop train. <laughs> Ooh, floated teapot. Mm, I don't know why I'm looking at it. I don't know. Bye, flesh stick. Yes, 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 explode, yes! Alright, let's go finish the train to catch and uh, potentially progress the story even more. What quests have I not done? Uh, oh, these two. Yeah, that's fine. Hmm. 
No, water crossing. First, we gotta check the toilet to see uh, if this rocket launcher is any good. Nope. Sometimes toilet rockets are just not as good as car trunk rockets, you know? But you always gotta check them toilets because you never know when someone hides their good rocket launcher in there. Ooh. I'm ready, Tina. I'm ready. I'm ready to stop the train. Because I wasn't the conductor. And it's not a poop train. Or a cycle train. Oh, that didn't kill me. Boring. Boring. End of the line. For this train because I was not conducting it. I was not its conductor. Search the train cars. They're probably keeping the vault key in the most fortified one. Um, let's compare. That is a lot more cruel damage. We'll, we'll, we'll do this. We'll use the teapot. Anything good. Ooh, there we go. There's some. There's some melee right there. Any roid. Amp. Um, probably not going to get any benefits out of amp. Uh, an action adaptive shield could use that extra health, mm, but no roid, so we're just gonna keep our boom. Oh wow, this one has a oh, I'm on fire. Uh, this has a laser sight, so pretty goddamn accurate. You can stop exploding now, shield. I prematurely activated you. I didn't mean to do that. Alright, now we can go boom. Get out of here. Restore my life. No. Why? Why would you betray me, money? The Hyperion Corporation wishes to remind you that heroes die many deaths. Cowards taste but one. Or something. Okay. It was all the money's fault. It didn't save my life. What am I supposed to do if the money doesn't save my life? That is so sad. Get out of here, Exploders. No one wants you here. All you do is ruin days and friendships and just 
Happiness. You ruin happiness. Is that a roid shield with bandit? Yay! Roid! Since we're going melee for a little while, I might as well use a roid shield. And. Okay. Give me everything! Don't worry. If Jack really wanted to protect the bunk key, it wouldn't be on a train. He'd have Wilhelm guard it. Oh dear. It's Windhelm! Not with that attitude rolling. Not with that attitude rolling. Oh, things are getting really bad. I don't know why I decided to try and melee fight him. Oh, Corrosive Teapot. Defend me! Oh, I wish I had something to heal me. Eh. Get out of here! Yay! We did it! All because of my grenade! Anything good? The long gun? No. Like my baby steaks. I've seen a power core like that. The one you got from Reese is nearly burned out. What's that? What a big rock. Like here? He didn't drop the Logan's gun or anything cool. Damn you, Winhelm. I threw two baseballs at you. And you didn't give me anything in return. You just kept my baseballs. So the problem I have with Krieg, especially if you go melee Krieg, or melee zero that I'd be that fact, is that when you fight bosses like Windhelm that aren't very effective against melee, you're just going to have a hard time unless you have ways to, uh, unless you have ways to get around the melee. So that's one problem I have with Krieg. Um, luckily, I was prepared for it, but there's going to be another boss up here in a little later. Uh, actually, a lot of bosses up here a little later that's going to have a big problem with melee. Hopefully, that fastball is still good by that time. Well, I could drink it down. You know what? We'll drink it down this time. We'll be a drunk this run. <laughs> Alright, so before uh, we turn in a train to catch, I want to do this little quest right here. Because it's not that hard. It should take us about like 10 minutes. And it's free experience. And you know me, I like free experience. It's the best. We're also getting to the point of the game where we're actually going to start getting into the more interesting and useful guns. Um, after these next couple quests here. So we'll actually be able to flesh out our build a little bit better than what we were originally having to do. Because we should be into those areas where we'll start getting all kinds of the fun stuff. So hopefully here in about, uh, I say an hour or so, we should be getting some pretty good equipment for melee builds. Uh, for either the cycle or the assassin, either works. Yeah. So keep, keep, if you're here, you get that. You gotta get one hour or so, we're gonna get some interesting rate stuff. Not raid stuff. Interesting uh, melee stuff. Which will uh, make Creed even more fun. Yay for fun Creed. Which is the name of the psycho. It's the name of the psycho. His name is Creed. Not Three Dog. It's Creed. And the reason I named him Three Dog is because last stream I got a I had a shotgun called Three Dog and I wanted to name him after Three Dog, you know, like Three Dog from Fallout Three, the uh, the dude that's like, hey, oh, I forgot what he says. He's like freedom, or not freedom, but like the path. Why don't you 
Scanners aren't mutated, so they're yes, 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 yes. themselves. <laughs> <laughs> they're We'll do a little choppy chop here, clear out this mine for baby girl Lilith. And then we'll run out at the wrong time. Stop shooting me, you're a badass. No! Come on, Hyperion shotguns. Prove to me that you're good. Get styled upon! How did I miss that? I told you what would happen. Woo! Alright, if you pull this, you're gonna activate an alarm. And you're gonna have to deal with more bad guys, which could be fine. But I have no more cycle, so we're not gonna do that. Instead, we're gonna come up here. And we are going to get past all of these pistons. Run, Psycho, run! And then we're gonna try and get up here. There we go. And then we're gonna go kill all the assholes up here. You want him to let you transform? Oh no, he killed you. How could he be so mean? Ah, oh, too high. No, I'm out! You're all gonna die to shotgun! Who are the we shot? I have to, because I have to reload you, asshole. Never stop the killing! Never! The Hyperion Corporation wishes to ever die your men. Is that overkill ability even useful? Because I get full health every time I kill something with Buzzsaw, and that's where all my damage is coming from. Hmm. It might actually not be that useful unless I don't have Rampage on. That's actually interesting. I'm actually thinking about stuff here. I guarantee you Hyperion would have done the same after the mind dried up. Go check with Tina. She's got a job for you. I'm coming, Tina! Give me jobs! I love experience! Happiness! I don't think the overkill damage is actually that useful. At least not right now. Because I'm not really doing that that much extraordinary damage as of right now. I mean, let me look into this. Yeah, I don't think this will be that useful just yet. Yeah, because if I pair if I pair this ability with say this ability, then I should be able to constantly heal myself when I'm clearing out mobs. Hmm, interesting. I'm gonna have to look into this a little bit more. Good decision! Good decision! Good! What's the uh, ability for this? Oh, this is just fireballs, right? Blood explosion! Yeah, I think we're not going to go into overkill damage after all, because I'm not really doing too much damage if I kill something with a gun. And yep, if yep, I yep, really yep, needed yep. a heal, I would just use my, uh... Sounds like a job for high explosives, am I right? I would just use my a, ability, my yeah. buzzsaw to heal. Don't want that Firehawk anymore. We're going full Roid now, baby. We'll get the Bloodhawk again later in a different world, in a different time. Should probably grab this dynamite so I can actually, you know, do the mission. That'd be nice. Those miners you fought earlier were paid cash in exchange for Olivia. Mm. Get to the station where their payroll train comes in, and we'll have ourselves a good old fashioned train robbery. Train robbery! Woo! 
You hear that, Creed? We're gonna have a train robbery. So let's murder everything along the way. Pop that open. Bandits used this station to rob passing trains. You're gonna have to use it to steal the bandits' payroll. Gotta love the irony. Well, what am I doing? It's time to go full damage. I'm free! Your hitbox is so bad! Oh my goodness, thank you. Thank you for costing me my entire time in Buzzsaw Rampage. Now I'm going to die because you're an asshole and your hitbox is absolutely terrible. Overkill, please! Give me your damn loot! Taking damage! All the damage! I think there's someone over there! No, I'm on fire! No, I'm not the right class for that! That wasn't the right build for me to be on fire! How dare you, enemies! How dare you? Give me this money. Good. That'll leave the train nowhere to go. Trade request received. Payroll train dispatched. <laughs> uh oh, don't want to be here. That would have been bad. That train would have killed me. And then I would have been sad. I also don't want to use the teapot anymore. I like the anarchist a little bit more. And even has a higher corrode chance. Don't really need it to corrode anything. I just want the extra damage. That I do to uh, enemies. Armored enemies because it's corrosive. Great job. The train is trapped. And now to wait 15 seconds, or 20, maybe 30, while I wait for them to talk this out. Ooh, I actually got on top of the train. Alright, quickly, let's get on top of the train. Yay! Now we get all the money! And then boom, boom! Give me all this money. Conductor distress signal received. Dispatching troops to payroll train number six two seven. And we're rich. We're rich. Good job, all of us. Now, if I was zero, I would have come over here and bored everything. What? Boom! And that's it. Those are the two quests that I wanted to do before we turn in a train to catch. Um, really nothing important you get from this quest other than a shit ton of money. Uh, I don't think it gives us any good rewards. No, I don't know what kind of grenade that is. But yeah, just an easy, this is a little easy way to get some experience and a lot of money before this upcoming uh, part. <laughs> Yay for free experience and money! You got a good chunk of money from that quest. When you made it rain, I was oh, like you get the fluster cluck. I don't know, is the Fluster Clock any good? I'm not Too not a hundred percent sure. Uh, you know what? We'll do this just just for fun. We'll have fun. We'll have some fun with Krieg. And then we'll be like, yeah! 
So I'm saving and quitting right now, not to end the stream, oh, not by any stretch, we've got a lot of work ahead of ourselves. No, I'm saving and quitting so I could jump back into the game and I'll be at the, uh, I'll be at the respawn station where I can, or fast travel station where I can easily go back to Sanctuary. And there we go, see, shortcuts, it even works better if you're not on, a uh, on any modes. If you're offline, it won't have to update session. I believe, anyway. Uh, the Fuster Clock. You know, I want to take a look at this Fuster Clock. Oh, boy. That's actually not bad. Woo! <laughs> That's actually going to be a little bit fun. Oh, dude, let's do it. Alright, we're going to go to Three Horns Divide. Because I think it's a little bit quicker this way. Uh, it depends. Oh, well, we got two loading screens, so it might not be that fast. It actually might be slower. Especially since I have to pick the right car. And then I have to turbo. All the way over here. I don't think that's faster at all. Well, let's see how long it takes to get in the sanctuary. 300 years later. Yay! Out. Welcome back, oh. Talking Shotgun. I missed you. As much as I can use the shotgun attack, that core you brought us earlier is nearly burnt up. Why don't you pop it out? Okay, oh. I think we're in business. What the hell? Why would you no. use anything Hyperion? Since Jack is able to control it all. Especially since the train was a trap. What made you think this was a good idea, Roland? This is why your future isn't too bright. Or long. You actually have a short future ahead of you. Pretty short. Speedrun tactics, which is not speedrun at all because I'm moving pretty slow and I'm Krieg. Why would you? Is there even a good route to speedrun with Krieg? I mean, there might be. I'm just not. I'm just not reading into it too deeply. Krieg might be a terrible speedrunner because of how risky he plays. Look, I even made it back before this thing was fully up. Yay! I'm here, Lilith. I'm actually here before you are. There you are! Now run away! Run away before it's GG! Before it's GG! No! No, I'm coming. Man, this is one of them moments. Catch a ride! I'm coming. Don't leave me. How did I get over there in the first place? That's actually a really good question. How did I get over there in the first place if the bridge is destroyed? That's actually a really good question. What? How did I get over there the first time? Did I climb down and climb back up? That doesn't make any sense, Gearbox. Doesn't make any sense at all. Alright. Well, now we have no sanctuary, so if you wanted to get upgraded with Iridium, now you can't. Until you complete this next section. So, yep, we have no reading upgrades, we have no safety, we have the no safety of, uh, Sanctuary. 
And now we have Jackass Jack just randomly talking to us now because he thinks he's won. But jokes on him, the tire I just ran to is a bigger threat than him. So now begins the race back to Sanctuary from the Happy Pig Motel. Did I turn the power on at the Happy Pig Motel? I did not. So if you've done this quest here earlier, uh, to turn on the power back to the Happy Pig Motel, you will actually have a new quest right now um, from Claptrap that is another quick and easy quest to go do. You just have to clear out a bandit camp and put down dynamite and blow some stuff up. A more easy experience if you want to do it, but sadly I don't want to turn on the power back to that area because I see it as a waste of time. I believe you get nothing from the quest you could do there right now if you have the power on. So you don't have to worry about it too much. Nothing good anyway. Probably just a green or a blue. No! I hit all the wrong buttons! Now you get to go boom! No, we go boom together! Hey, a reading I can't use. Alright, so now let's head to a brand new series of areas. Let's head on to the fridge. The first of three new areas we'll get to explore before we get to go back to Sanctuary. This is the point of the game where if you're not really that geared, you might be having some problems. I believe this is a little bit of a difficulty spike um, compared to the other areas. Get out of here, Phil Rat. As we get to deal with the rats now. Get Fluster Clucked! Fluster Cluck! Oh, it never works. Never works. You field rats are actually very powerful. No, no, where the hell you think you're going? Yay! Ooh, I might actually be in trouble. Wasting time. Let's go boom. Alright, now I see why the fluster plug doesn't seem that great. Because it's not instant. Maybe if the grenades were instant, it might be better. There we go. Now we have everything under control. Open your veins. Get out of here, Rack! Ooh, we got a one-armed bandit, everybody! Let's make him corrosed. And then shoot him with a shotgun. Then reload. Then continue shooting him with a shotgun. Alright, screw you, Rax. I'm gonna play the lottery. I'm gonna play slots. Whatever this is called. Is this slots? It might be slots. I don't know. I don't I don't gamble. I just play baseball. Don't you dare steal my money because your hitbox is terrible. Don't you dare do that, you ass. Hey, Atlas, they don't exist no more.
You guys are actually older than me. Who burns dead? Huh, you think you could escape me? You're about to go boom, buddy. What the hell? Are you stuck in there? No, there you are. Well, I guess that's it. Uh, this shotgun is not performing the way I want it to be anymore, but I still got the knife. Come down, Pandora has no hope. Anything interesting? Ooh, the uncut herald. You have no reason to trust me, I get that. But if you're going to stop Jack from controlling the warrior, you'll need my help. Because I know where the key... Oh, did I accidentally shut her up during an important plot? progression. Oh, I'm so sorry, Angel. I'm so sorry. Not really. You talk too much. And Any Roy Keeled Spike, hey, Spike. No big deal. Find a way back here as quick as you can. Now that Sanctuary's reappeared, can use any fast travel station to get back to the Crimson Raiders. I'll mark the nearest one on your Echo device. Up one second. All right. Error. Location sanctuary not found. Oh no. The phase blast must have taken sanctuary off the fast travel network. <laughs> Oh hey, you guys want to know? You guys want to know how to rocket jump? Sadly, you can't rocket jump with this rocket, but there is a rocket you can rocket jump. A little later in the game, uh, much later. Probably won't get there till round four or five, depending on how much progress I make in this round. I need y'all to stop poking me. That'd be very nice if y'all stop poking me. Uh oh. Damn it. <laughs> Every time. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna get a second win on you. Uh, it does not look like it's high hope. Oh, but I did anyway. Yay for AoE! Rocket kill! That was terrible. So hot loaders, they will explode if you kill them, just like explosion loaders do. So if you kill them, you want to make sure you're far away or else they will uh, potentially kick your ass and kill you. I will try, hon. I will try my damnedest. You know what? I think I'm going to go back to the teapot because the teapot doesn't take down the count. We're going to pass everything and we're going to do something cool. Or fail trying to do something cool. Catch, robot! Yes! I did it! Oh, that was actually pretty cool. I'm so happy. Okay. Was that overkill damage? I mean, I guess I could heal myself off these goddamn grenades I have. Oh, please, turret. Not right now. Okay, I need a different plan for you. I'm out of grenades. Someone send help. Oh, it's time to go boom. It's time for boom! I'm dead. Oh, this might be GG for me. Get out of here, exploder. 
Constructor, I don't know why I'm reloading. That wasn't a smart idea. That wasn't a smart idea on my part. Yay, we did it. Level 19. Bleh. I want level 18 stuff. I'm not 19 yet. I don't want that. I'll take it so. Ooh, that would hurt. Alright, anything? Give me those grenades. I need those. I need those grenades. What do you got over here? Uh, no grenades! Damn it, Hyperion! The stop being stingy on your grenades. They're my only saving grace here. Don't you understand? Grenade! Oh, we're in trouble. This might be a hard boss fight. Can you can you please stop talking? All right. Thresher, prepare to get chopped. Okay, this is bad. That didn't go the way I wanted it to. Ooh, ooh, I have problems. No. Why? Why melee? I just wanted to kill something with melee. Okay, we got problems now. Mm, don't want to sneeze. Okay, we're gonna. This is why we have the unkept herald, just for situations like this. I should probably boost its damage with my explosion Any skill. Hyperion mm. robot able to terminate a pressure will be awarded with the ability to be proud of So even though this Uncamped Herald is really weak, it's still doing a lot of work. Oh, that shield is so annoying. Oh, now not the time, Exploders. I'm dead. But good thing I left this dude alive over here. Uncamped Herald, I believe in you! Uncapped Herald, I believe. I didn't even get the kill, but it still works in the end. Full heal me. Full heal me. Yay. I am no longer worried. Thank you, Uncapped Herald. That's why you're my favorite. And the most overpowered gun in the game. Well, not this particular unkept herald. If we had the double penetrating unkept herald, then we'd be in OP business. Good. We can use that to request an uncalibrated fast travel unit from the moon base. You'll need a quiet place to set up the beacon. Uh, okay. Thanks to Hyperion's operations, the changing weapons. And there you go, two out of the three areas we have fully explored. Not fully, I just ran through them. But welcome to the last area before we get back to Sanctuary. Oh, so Fuck that pixel see, rock. This is what I don't get about you bad guys. You know the hero's gonna win, but you just don't die quickly. Man, I, example, this one guy in New Haven, right? City's burning, people are dying left and right, yada yada yada. This jackal rushes me with a spoon. <laughs> a freaking spoon. And I'm like dying laughing, right? So I scoop out his stupid little eyeballs with it. And his kids are like, oh, yeah. And I, I can't even, oh, he, he can't see where he's going. He's bumping into stuff. And I, anyway, I don't know. Maybe you had to be there. The moral is, me. you're a total bitch. <laughs> All right, welcome to Overlook. Um, the next fun area for this quest. Uh, before we start this next round, though, let's see—is there anything good in here? 
Ooh, a corrosive SMG. That's not terribly bad. The floated teapot is better. Uh, doesn't look like there's anything decent in there. Uh, stock up. And before we begin this next area, I'm gonna go grab a drink and then we'll come back and finish up this route of uh, this quest. So I'll see y'all in a sec.
almost to farm. Mandatory tickets will be sent to each household next month. Alrighty, and we are back. It's transmitting the supply request now. We've just got to wait a few minutes and... Angel, that's enough. You can stop pretending to help the bad guys now. Angel? We don't have long until Jack realizes I'm not helping him anymore. Defend that beacon. Hmm. All right, so obviously, people who play Borderlands 2 know exactly what we're doing. But for those who do not, and what we're doing is we have to fight wave after wave after wave of robots, and we'll be doing this for like. 50 billion waves, not that many waves, but it's a lot of waves. Uh, the game wants you to think you have to defend the beacon, but don't worry, you don't have to defend the beacon. If they do kill the beacon, which they will, just because there's so many goddamn robots you have to kill. Um, if they do destroy the beacon, you'll be fine. All you have to do is the game will tell you to reset it. Which is just head up there and press square or X, whatever you're playing on. And when you do that, the beacon will get full health bar again. And then you just resume the wave of the robot. So it's not too big of a deal if it dies. So no worries. T Bone Junction! I'm sorry! I might actually die. Never mind. I'll live. Thank God my bus hawk occurred. Oh, that's not good. Oh well, get those exploders out of here. me dead. Gotta quickly repair the beacon, even though it doesn't matter. I could clear out this way first. But I'll repair the beacon if the game wants me to do so. Burn to death, gun loader. You too, gun loader. Oh, we got a constructor. So if you run out of ammo while you're doing this, you can just come over here and refill your ammo. No problem. You're stuck over here. By the way, he doesn't send everything after you, so don't worry. Hyperion suggests 
If he actually sent everything after you, you would not survive, and this quest would be impossible. Especially if he decided to send his Saturn robot. Killed a badass, now I die. But it's okay, I got a shield surveyor here. Oh no. Oh no. That was... Oh boy. Uh oh. Uh oh. Now I realize, now I remember why I hate this skill. Because it's so useless. It's not a good skill. The dynamite's not good. I hate it. I, when I looked at it, when I saw it the first time, I was like, huh, I remember not liking this skill, but I can't remember why. Now I remember why. Oh, hey, look, we won while being dead. Easy. Easy. And yay, get to go back to Sanctuary. We did it. We made it back home. Oh, Reese's, why? Where'd it go? Oh. There it is. Hmm. Celebrating that fight with the Reese's. And there you have it. We're back in Sanctuary. So when you come back to Sanctuary for the second time, you are going to have a lot of side quests. And this is the point of the game is where I am t was talking about where you'll start getting some of the more interesting and useful weapons of the game. Just full of loot and Moxie herself. I lost the second prize to Jack. First, with a thief named Carson. Hello, Master. I don't care if I never see those guns again. So I hope you're ready because now it's time for us to gear up our cycle the way we want. Uh, we'll come back to this quest here in a sec. Jack blasted my personal safe out of my own store. All right, so before we do this quest, uh, I'm going to reset my skills, and uh, we're going to invest in our points a little bit better. I want these two for sure. Uh, don't think this skill is important. This skill sucks. And, uh... This is not a bad skill in single player. It's actually really good. This is probably be the skill, or this one would probably be what the skills you want to go into. Uh, we'll do Strip the Flesh, because I don't think we need this one for now. Yeah, that looks good. And now we're gonna do this quest. Alright, so for this quest, some dude got killed. 
And for some reason, for this one dude, we have the law. <laughs> That's a funny joke. We have the law actually doing something about a death in Pandora. Um, if you want to know the quick and easy solution, there's always the guy with the sniper rifle. He's always the one that does it. You could accuse any yeah, one of these I guys. It. it doesn't matter which one you accuse. Uh, you'll get the same yeah. reward. Job, but it's always this asshole with the sniper rifle. I accuse you! Good job. What? And there we go. And for beating this quest, you will get the Jacob's Pistol Leather Law. Or just the law itself. But, the law is not a bad pistol, but as you can see, it comes with a hundred percent extra melee damage. Now this is an extremely good weapon, if not an important pistol for melee builds like the Psycho Melee or the Assassin Melee. So get ready to use this law if you're going melee because you really want this bonus. So that right there, that's what, that's why I pretty much went back to melee for the stream. Because I was hoping I'd get this far to get this weapon. But now it's time to dish out some melee damage. Private Jessup, you're not Bieber Cheeks this time. You're wearing sunglasses. You disappoint me. The city may be safe right now, but what happened? Oh, good. You're not dead. Yay! That's his way of saying, wow. Right. All right, so if you finish that quest, you finally get your fourth weapon slot if you're playing on normal mode. Yippee! Happiness all around. I don't really have anything useful to put in here. I guess we'll just leave the anarchist, the teapot in there for now. I'm gonna switch this with this. But good news is we have a lot of quests that will reward us with some decent, if not extremely good guns for this point in the game. Will you please just hear me out? Sure, let's listen to the crazy computer that just tried to kill us. Hey, remember that time she told us the volume? Also, I want the law to be on top. I don't really care for that shotgun anymore. Continue. The key naturally charges itself once every 200 years. All right, we'll come back to do that quest later. He's been using my power to forcibly charge the key with iridium. If you find me, you find the vault key. The vault key is housed in my AI control core. Hey, I won't give me a hand. It's protected by three impassable security panels. Oh, I can't do class trash quests because Angel's talking. Sad man. Alright, because I don't really care about the story, because I know the story like the back of my hand. And we are going to go to the fridge. And we're going to party in the fridge for a little while, do these easy quests at the fridge. And yes, they'll be talking here for a little bit longer, probably about one or two more minutes. It's quite the long cutscene, which progresses a plot, but who cares about plot? We're playing Borderlands. I want to murder stuff. Where's the frost? Oh boy, it did it to me again. No freaking... I guess, I mean frost, the fridge. I guess we're walking to the fridge by foot again. I don't know why, sometimes it just doesn't open the fridge for me. It doesn't give me the uh, fast travel station, and I don't know why. It's shitty, but oh well. Getting over there's not that hard. Three horns! You know what? You guys are going to get meleeed. Look at that damage. 
Look at that leather law damage. And the law isn't that bad about Jacob's pistol either. It's actually pretty good, especially this early when you get it. it has some nice damage to it. At least I think it's good. Other people might think it's bad. Who knows? Ooh, look at that Jacob's uh, rifle. Fast travel, please. Open this time. Do we have the fridge unlock? No, it's still it's still not unlocked, and I'm at the goddamn thing too. <laughs> what a freaking stupid thing! All right, we'll go save Lanny. Here's porn mag number one. I mean, girly magazine number one. Uh, I got racks. Uh, girly magazine number two is gonna be right here. Okay, y'all need to die. And yes, I believe the melee damage you get from your guns do stack with the melee damage you get just from um, the basic melee damage I have with Rampage. So, I believe that's the way it works. It's really awesome if it does work that way. I don't know. I don't remember. I'm gonna hope it does. And I need you racks to get out of here because you're gonna cause me problems later if I don't get rid of you. No more racks, right? Looks like we cleared them all. Alright, the last location of the girly magazines are going to be in this car right here. And there you go. Bonus objective all done. Now let's actually do the main objective. Yay! Oh, please kill something. Yay! Alright, you guys are being rude. So you get to die next. That's not good. That's actually the opposite of good. Alright. Okay. Come on, Law. Let's get some kills. You walk the Ooh. wrong dog. Oh, we got racks now. All dead. And dead. More racks. Thank you. 
snap your neck if you don't have one! Um, uh, need one more flower. I lost track of what I was doing there for a second. I was just killing everything in the way. No, this is the uh, PS4 version, the Handsome Collection. The, uh, you know, the big remake that they had for PS4 and the Xbox Uno. The Xbox Uno. Exactly, Shooter. Why would you ever be a cannibal if there's pizza? Yeah, sorry, man. It's also easier to stream on the uh, PS4 than it is to stream on a PS3. I need to get special stuff to stream on a PS3. So, PS4 is the way to go for me. I am going the wrong way. Still, it's not a bad, not a bad game on the PS3. I remember playing the crap out of it on the 360 days. I don't want to set myself on fire, but I guess I'm on fire now. Oh, I'm dead. Oh boy. Oh boy. That was not a good idea. Go! Oh. Uh, please shield. But you're in the fridge, you stupid rat. Get rid of greedy and bloody. Oh, we got one more. Creepy! Oh, damn, I one shot at him. Don't need to go this way just yet. Uh, not till after I find the other quest that's here. Goliath, are you here somewhere, buddy? No? Nothing over there? Come out, Goliath. I need your quest. Yes, so I could get it done. There you are. That won't stop me. There it is.
They didn't steal anything from me, did they? Nope. Good, 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 good. Trouble here. Turn invisible. Your hitboxes get weird when you turn invisible. Over here, you asshole. What the hell do you think you're doing? I'm trying to get healed off you. You're just freaking backstepping like there's no tomorrow. Uh, I'm not good at fighting stalkers, that's Creed. At least not yet. Shorty with a shock weapon. I mean, if the shock fastball counts, then yeah, this will be easy. Oh, it worked. Alright, we're done here. Screw you. Aww. What are you guys? Screw you, stalkers. You're the second worst enemies in the game compared to buzzards. I hate you. I hate you all. Is that? No, there's one more quest. One more quest. Yeah, we gotta go do this one now. Yes, 
Should I keep the Herald? I am about to hit 20. Sorry, Herald. Uh, I don't think you're going to be of use to me in these upcoming parts. Backpedalers. No, ho, ho. he hit me while I was trying to throw the grenade. Oh, that's so sad. You, you're probably the easiest one to kill here out of everything. Oh, and he shot his laser. Oh man, this is actually pretty bad. I need to get out of here. Can't believe I actually survived that. No! You damn rats! You're too strong! Get out of here. God damn these rats. Those lab rats are probably the strongest version of rats you'll have to deal with. And they are rough. They're rough and tough. Rough and tough and buff all at the same time. <laughs> so what were what my skills going into? Oh, I was putting them in explosion damage. Which is actually not a good idea because I don't have anything that does explosion other than my rocket launcher. I probably should have thought that through a little bit. Yay! Don't you fire your lasers at me! Don't fire your laser at me! I'll just health gate your ass. I see meat muscles. Up! I'm reloading. Get over here and smell Ah, you me. stupid rocket launchers and you I'm reload. Never sorry. Okay. Where are you where are you at? Give me my stuff back. Ooh, not bad. What kind of Jacob scum was that? Is it a wheelie? No. It's a gallon gun. Anything interesting? Ooh, grenade. No, you guys are doing way too much damage. I wish I could do that much damage. Okay, let's see. I have no health. I'm about to have my super back. Or my action skill back, which is going to be what I need. Uh, I guess we'll just clear out this room with our action skill. Now, if I could just have better ability to see. Oh, you guys do so much damage. Ugh! 
You can handle the law! The law commands you! Okay. Before we turn that in, we're going to clear out this last dude over here. Oh, we're just going to get completely ambushed by everything. Buzzsaw! I don't understand how that buzzsaw missed, but it did. Alright, let's turn in this quest and, uh... Hope we don't get our asses kicked. Hey, we got the roaster, everybody. And you know what? We'll use it. Why not? Oh, let's smash it! Woo! Oh, this actually has a big magazine. Oh, that's not bad at all, actually. You know what? I was going to reset my uh, explosion damage, but now that I got this, I think this... Holy crap. Speaking of getting some awesome shit, we got Sledge Shotgun! Woo! It's not that great of a weapon in later difficulties, but I can't believe he dropped it. And what is this? Grenade capacity plus five! And kill skill durations plus five. Woo! Ooh, I could play around in this tree if I get that. Hmm, not bad. Alright, let's see what we actually got in here. Useless, useless, and even more useless. But I do want to spend that skill point. It's probably going to be on this now, because I'm going to use this rocket launcher. Ooh, and this legend shotgun actually does fire damage. Wow, that's actually a really good find. Thank you, Smash Head. It's time to hammer. Open your veins. So that just sounded so you want him with that I pretty much double my damage. Oh lab rat, why? Now I'm gonna have to use this. Now you should be scared. Oh hell yeah, you should be super scared. <laughs> oh man, this just got a lot more fun, let me tell you. Now I'm having a blast. I want a full heal. Slice. Oh, the animation would hurry the fuck up. Oh no, we're not done yet, buddy. We're not done yet. I will murder you, and you will die. Not a bad, not bad. Dude, this is, this is getting interesting now. Got quite a good weapon setup. Gonna be even better if we get the weapon from this guy. It's time to face your living fear. It's Rackman! Who is dead and then drop his gunnerang. Oh. Whoa, Rackman, where are you going? Rackman, oh! <laughs> he 
Rocky. Rockman, he's here to save the day. He's here to do nothing. Oh man, we are going to uh, save that. Oh, that's going on YouTube, all right. That's going to be a fucking moment right there. Stream moment. Rockman away. And then I found four Ridian. Uh, crap. That's not that bad. Crap. Crap. But I'm full voice in my head. What do you want me to do? I'm full. I mean, the voice in my head told me to grab it, so I have to drop something. Uh, these three whites could go. You're welcome, voice in me head. Alright, and, uh... With that, we are done in the fridge. Permanently. There's never... There's actually only one reason to ever come back here and I'm not gonna come back here for that reason so we're pretty much done here a hundred percent yay so let's head back home and never come back to the fridge ever again Until our second playthrough. Invisible assholes. Mm, don't want any of this. Don't need that anymore. Good, 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 good. Let's see here. Okay, so now that we're done with all that, what else do we got to do? Could go to Caustic Caverns. Uh, these two quests should be on my to-do list right now. These are some good quests to do. Uh, don't think I'm going to do any of these except this one. So there's one mission I want to do in the Highlands. The dust will probably be what I do next. Mm, Toss Cavern would actually be pretty easy. Let's do Slap Happy first though because it's not that hard of a quest. Let's head back to Sanctuary and get that done. Uh, this way first. Rockets! Rockets! What's my iridium at? 30? That's some upgrades right there. More perks have perks! No grenade for right now. We'll do, uh... Well... I am, the fastball is still pretty useful to me and I am having a lot of fun, but it will become useless to me here shortly. We'll do the rocket for now. Because I'm going to be using this rocket a lot. And those three extra missiles means three more freaking huge amounts of damage. Scooter, it's me, your buddy, the psycho. Thanks again, freaking rats, man. I was close to putting out what second base feels like. 
All right, we're done with you for now, Scooter. All right. We're going to go do a uh, Slap Happy because that's a quick and easy one. It gives us a good chunk of experience. The shotgun it gives us is pretty good, too, but I think I'll keep sledges for now. Science demands I forgive it. Vengeance demands I kill it. Today, my friend, you will be my vengeance. Take my hand. I already took your hand, buddy. Sorry, it's already been done. Outwash! Welcome to the Outwash. Let's go kill old Slappy! I probably should have done the dust missions first, but I don't really care about the rewards from them too much right now. Should I do the clan war? It is, I really do enjoy that mission. It's a really good set of missions, but it's a long set of missions. And I don't know if I should do them. I am kind of, don't not too over leveled, but I'm up to par. I could just blaze through the story. No, we'll do the clan. You know we'll do the clan war because the clan war's fun. It's a fun mission, and we're here to have fun. But first, we gotta kill old Slappy. Now we'll do the dust missions. And then we'll go to Highlands. See if I could get the one item I want over there. It's old Slappy. Bye, Slappy. I'm gonna swallow your throat, badass. Beware Slappy's tentacles. You lost them in half, but they'll regenerate sooner or later. You have nothing on us, old Slappy. Oh, don't worry, I got the free reload. And we're done. Not good. Hmm. Fire rate after kill. What are these skills? Boiling blood and taste of blood. They're not here, that's for sure. Taste the uh, taste of blood, and we're just boiling blood. Nah, there you go. Nah. That one's pretty good. Nothing over here. Uh, I think this is just money over here. Yup. We got nothing from old Slappy. The sadness. But at least he's dead, and with that, we could be happy. A dying puppy. A baby in tears. Give me the previous statement. Report to your supervisor for summary instructions. Flat off with a long uh, barrel. That probably make the front end of the gun very heavy. Actually, while we're here, I'm gonna go to Overlook. Because there's actually a mission I want to do here. I'm going to try and get it done now. We're not doing this mission. This mission's stupid. Stupid and hard and stressful. Not that stressful, but could be. I don't like this mission. It doesn't even give you a good reward other than experience. Blech. We're gonna do stalker stalkers. That's what we want. 
Elizabeth Taggart was hired to wipe out the stalker population a while back. He also adorably tried to write a book about his adventures in the Highlands. You'll find the chapters of his book now plagiarize the living daylights out of the mine. Win, 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 as they say. Nobody says that. I say it. Win! Everyone wins! Get out of here. So to do this mission, you have to search these, uh, you have to search these, the goop balls that Threshers leave behind in order to find the chapters. Don't really have really good luck here. You stalkers are being assholes right now. There we go. Burn to death. Is that Iridium? No, it was just blood. Just their blood. Now we'll watch the stalker burn to death. He's not gonna burn to death, so I'll shoot him again. Anything in here? Nope. Will you stop backpedaling? God, I just want to smack you with my buzzsaw. Anything in here? Nope. In here? Nope. Nope. There's one. Nope. It is a known nope. fact that stalkers find Agar recorders delicious. You'll likely find the rest of Taggart's chapters within miles of stalker defecation. There's a the second one. Jack was a kitty. These stalker things are something. I pounded one right in the throat with my thumping hammer. Just like my time. And it pretty much exploded. It made this hilarious noise like... <laughs> It's kind of like that. I should make it my ringtone. Let's see what's over here. What? Nothing. 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 And nothing. We're just gonna go to the area where I always get these, uh... Where I always get these stupid, uh, chapter echologs. Because my luck is very low right now. So we'll just go to the very simple area and do it. We. Alright, so if you want the easy way to do this mission, just come over here to the mill. Uh, you might want to start by shooting these two out over here. You might get lucky. Unless you're me. And if you come in here, you just got a lot of shit you could pile through. Usually you can find all five of them in here pretty easily. See, there's one right there. Mother's 
Mother's Day! Mother's Day! You hear that, Henry? Mother's Day! And there it is, there's all five chapters. of that character. Oopsie daisy, oh wells. It happens to the best of us, not really. See, if he was actually Brick, then he wouldn't have to worry about any of that because he would have got all kinds of crazy bonuses to his melee. But he wasn't a brick. I, handsome Jack, am moderately happy to welcome you into the Hyperion family. What was that? Molly Wand damage. I don't even use Molly Wand. Do I even have Molly Wand equipped? No, it's Bandit I have. Bandit! Suppose there's a lesson to be learned in all of this. That's not that great of a weapon, and I have no use for that shield. Apologies. Alright, so now that that quest is done, the next quest will open up. Um, but to do that next quest, you are going to have to kill stalkers, I believe around this area and to get the item you need to drop I'm just gonna go to the known location that I go to to fight these guys where I get the item to drop because this next quest is actually the one I want to do because the reward I get from it is actually something I want so away you're not a stalker you're a thrasher and I don't need thrashers. I want stalkers. Because stalkers are more important. Isotope Reclamation Tower. I think is that what that said. I hear you stalkers. Okay, now if I was actually any good at the game. There it is. This is the quest we could do now because we did that first quest. Yay, now we get our own chance to fight Henry. Now let's go get Eden just like this guy did. Because it's Henry. Woo. All right, Henry, I'm coming to kick your ass or get eaten or both. And I think I went too far. God damn it, car, this is all your fault. Here's the entrance. I'm coming for you, Henry! You know, they should have made the optional objective for this mission to melee Henry, since the dude who was hunting him originally punched the crap out of these stalkers. And the reward we're getting is an extremely good shield for melee users, if not one of the best. Yeah, I don't know why they didn't give us the uh, optional objective to melee. They should have done that. 
What, you don't think I can't kill Henry with a melee attack? It doesn't matter if his hitbox is terrible. Or if my hitbox is terrible. Where the hell did it go? Oh, you asshole. Roar, I'm a stalker. Henry, where are you at, boy? I want to fight. There you are. I see the numbers of fire on you. You can't hide from me. Okay. Different plan. I'm rising. And Dunyan Rings. Ooh. Give me all that Iridian. What's this? Nah. Give me the Love Thumper. The Love Thumper has a lot of Roy damage. And you can see the recharge delay on it is over 213 seconds long. The gimmick of the Love Thumper is that when the shield is gone, you get Roy damage, which increases your melee damage for as long as the shield remains knocked out. That's the gimmick of the Love Thumper. Extremely, extremely good shield to have on melee builds. If not, probably one of the most important shields other than other ones like Order or the Higher Terramorphous. And it's one of the easiest, it's probably the easiest Roy shield to use because of its long downtime. And that's what we're going to be using for quite a while. 300, like 400, the 400 Roy damage it gives me isn't that high. Well, it is very high for normal mode, but it won't be higher, it won't be that high for later modes. So we will have to replace it when we go to True Vault Hunter mode, but goddamn are we going to be a monster with all this melee damage we have. And now that we're done with that, how long have we been going? I don't know, my stream. Still streaming, right? Oh, didn't mean to do that. Let's double check to see if we're streaming. Didn't mean to do that either. Sorry, missile. The second bottle of aspirin. Yay! Twitch still says I'm streaming, so I am going to believe it. Yay, streaming! <laughs> All right, so to give you an idea of what the Love Thumper does, I oh, didn't mean to do that. Liver. Pretty much, if you kill the shield, you're not going to have a shield for like 213 seconds. Even longer if you are playing Creed and are going down his middle tree. So hopefully, your you melee builds like melee zero and melee Krieg get a lot of use out of this. It's ex really good on Krieg too because he has a lot of abilities that doesn't want him to have shields. Like this one right here. Because if our shield goes down in battle, we're not going to have it for like 220 seconds. We're going to have pretty much a permanent bonus of 70% more melee damage. Which is extremely, extremely good. See, now the overkill might actually start working here. No, not really. Because if well, we get a lot of, I don't know. I'm not too sure. This would probably be better than explosion damage at this point. Uh, salt the, we are going to start getting salt the room. You know what? I think I'm going to move these points into fuel the rampage. Before we head to the dust. Time is 10.13. I could stop the stream, but I'm having a little bit too much fun now, especially now that I got the Love Thumper. So we're going to push on. We're going to push on for a little bit longer. 
We are gonna go to Sanctuary, reset my shields again. I'm sorry, I'm as a Creek player, uh, he has a lot of fun stuff to play around with. And I just want it all. Give it to me all. Give it all to me. Didn't want to do that. We already fucked up. So this skill here, the pull the pin, I don't like it. Don't like it at all. Probably one of the most useless skills he has. Well, that's not true. I would say this is probably the most useless skill he has. Alrighty, there we go. And when we actually start going down and salt the womb, salt the wound, then taking damage is what we actually want. Uh, this is this is a skill I really want, but we got about eleven levels before we get there. Ooh, let's actually go and turn in old slappy. Turn in old slappy. Old slappy. Scientifically, murdering old Slappy was probably a bad idea. Vengeance is strictly. I thank you for your help. Yay! And we get a point in Salt the Wound. Now we get the build up stacks of even more melee damage. So let's see 1.5 times 5, 15 times 5 would be 75%, so it'll be 7.5% melee damage per stack times 20. So let me pull out my calculator here. 7, oh, whoops, 7.5 times 20. So that's 15, no, that's 150% extra melee damage at max sets. We are just gonna have so much melee damage on this guy. What does this do? Oh, there you go. There you go. That's the skill I really do want. That's, that's the skill right there that sets this entire build into motion. So, full melee. Full melee. All oh, that melee damage, dude. It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. Alright, let's go find Carson. We're gonna go find Carson, get the item, to get the reward from this quest, because the reward from this quest is gonna help us a lot. Not help us a lot, but it'll make us level faster. Spoilers, it's uh, they give us Moxie's endowment from this quest. And it, that gives us extra experience. And then we'll go do the clan wars. And then we'll see how I feel after that if I should continue streaming or head into the cost of cavern sex. Oh, he's up there. No. The Clan Wars is a really long quest, so our quest line, so we're probably gonna be doing it for a good thirty or so minutes. Must be suicidal. Let me show you what suicidal means. That wasn't suicide at all. That was me cutting him in half with my bus saw. Keep the blood pouring! Excuse me, sir. I want you to die. What was this weapon? Oh, yeah, it was such a shotgun. No, I almost got to him. Now you should be scared. Now you should be scared. Where's the chest, Carson? What was that noise? Welcome to it. It sounded like some Aryan screw. It sounded like a friend, though. It sounded like a friend. 
Do I get an explosion nova every time I kill something? I believe... Yeah, I do. I forgot I get a nova explosion every, after with the Roy damage as well. I forgot about that. Love Thumper, you're such a great shield for melee. I love this thing on Krieg. Not only does it make me go boom, but it makes me go boom! I like the fact that this weapon was made in the vanilla, but it goes so in the vanilla Borderlands 2 before DLC, and it goes so good with a DLC character they made much later. Oh. Other than that, Zero was probably the only one who actually got any use out of the shield because everyone else really wanted to keep their shield. Maybe Salvador if you want to do the early game money shot inconceivable. Which I don't know why you would want to. You don't really need that much DPS on a Salvador. <clears throat> we don't need any shields. You Not right now, me. anyway. Uh, any yeah. good class mods? You know, we'll take that extra health. We'll be a slab. Because I don't need this torch skill. Let's just get this out of the way. Yeah. I'm coming to kill you, robots. I hope you're ready and full of fear. No, I got stuck. Oh, stop getting stuck. Please jump me. It'd be nice if the robots actually showed up. Don't want to melee you. Well, that was bad luck on my part. No, you stupid asshole, you shot the barrel on purpose. You did that on purpose. No, no, the reload. Oh, I can't believe my shield actually came back. Come on, knock out my shield. Knock out my shield. There you go. Don't want to accidentally hit you. Look at this melee damage. Oh, you're all in for pain. Oh, don't think, don't think just because you're up there I can't get you. Oh, that was bullshit. Damn exploders, my only weakness. And this damn surveyor is going to come up behind me and finish me off. Just you watch. Or he's going to get stuck up there. this gun anymore. So I'm gonna use the Droog instead! Yay for Droogs! Oh, is it free yet? Where the hell is this thing? Where's it stuck at? I hear it. I have a Droog with your name on it! Ugh. 
Damn it. God, can everything stop being explosion loaders? surveyors I appreciate that I appreciate you Jack shoving exploders and surveyors down my throat constantly oh you must be nice thank you do I get a melee bonus for this let's find out Yes, I do. That's actually very good to note. Get rid of you. Droog! Oh, I'm out of armor for the Droog. Oh, sadness. Don't want to melee you. In fact, I don't want anything to do with y'all. Now I'm gonna die because I stepped in the corrosion. No. Stay there, surveyor. Thank you. Surveyor, why? Full of opportunity. Get rid of everything. I'm gonna keep the droog. Even though it's not that great of a weapon on Krieg, I'll still use the droog! And I want another Reese's Buttercup. Got two left. So I'm gonna eat this one very slowly. Oh no, they're all tearing. Never mind eating them slow, I gotta eat them before they melt. Let's go find the stash. <coughs> Actually, before we do that, I'll BRB one more time to go refill my drink. So, uh, enjoy our quest. You know what? Enjoy my badass rank. How about that? 27 badass tokens.
testing. Hey everyone, I'm back. All right, let's go do the good, the bad, and the Mordecai. Almost done with it. This is actually the last part of the mission. Uh, what we have to do is we have to head behind Ellie's uh, auto shop over here. And uh, we just gonna have to do a little run. It's quite a ways. I'm not gonna deal with these. Well, you know what? Droog! You got Droog. You want, you want to get Droog too? You got Droog. Droog! So, pretty much what uh, Droog is, is the barrel attachments on a Vladoff weapon. Um, if you get a Vladoff weapon with the barrel attachment, that's uh, two barrels and they spin, that's the uh, Droog attachment. And it turns sniper rifles into like a mini assault rifle. I mean, or a mini mini uh, a mini mini gun. And they are really powerful. Because you have the power of a sniper rifle and all the crit that you get, the crit bonuses that you get with a sniper rifle, and you could you could melt a lot of things with a Drew sniper rifle. Uh, I'm gonna stop dealing with these spirans so I can show you what I mean. Ooh, it's a Nova every time I hit. That's actually really cool. I'm gonna die, yep. <laughs> I saw my health slowly going down. Alright, Knight, you asked for it. God, I still have to reload that piece of shit. No, I can't die here. Oh, thank God. I didn't want to run all the way back. I am going to reload this piece of shit at long last. Yay, and we're going to make sure everything else is reloaded. Except the law. Because I'm coming in and I'm going to explode you, knight. Woo! Did he drop anything? Nope, just blood. And here we are, Boot Hill. Give me that treasure. But wait. It's Mobley. But not just that, it's also Ghetto. Whoa! <laughs> Draw! And he's already dead. <laughs> uh, that's always that's always hilarious. <laughs> And it's time for us to take all this loot and Moxie the Endowment, which is the main reason why we came over here. If you don't care for Moxie's Endowment, which you probably won't care if you're max level, there's another reason to activate and do this quest, and it's because of this guy right here. This guy, Ghetto, I believe, um, if you kill him, he has a chance of dropping a legendary Droog Flatoff rifle. Which I forget the name off the top of my head, but it's an extremely good uh, uh, sniper rifle. It's the same thing as what I have in my hand, but god damn is it powerful. A must have if you are playing on Zero, or just anyone in general. It's a really good weapon for everyone. Maybe not Krieg because he doesn't benefit uh, from sniper rifle damage increases and critical increases but everyone else really good weapon and I'm gonna go over here and see if I could run into a well, certain enemy which I don't think I can because I don't know how to activate this enemy no 
I don't know how to turn on the Black Queen. If there even is a way to turn uh, her encounter on. Does it have to do with you, Marauder? Or does he just spawn randomly? You can't stop me! So sadly, the Nova is around me, so if I get a kill with my axe, it won't count. But other than that, this Nova is just a lot of extra DPS. Especially if I go down the explosion skill, that increases my explosion, and it's just a lot of fun. Nothing makes me stronger than a sucking chest wound. So right now, what you're seeing is Krieg in his beta. But soon, as we level higher and get into higher difficulties, we'll enter his alpha, and then we'll enter his full release, where it's just constant explosions and death and buzzsaw murders everywhere. Everywhere. And I don't, there's really not a reason why I'm killing everything here. I just want to see if I can make a certain mob spawn. Because I don't know how to make uh, this mob spawn. Pretty much a uh, certain, a special spider ant should spawn around here somewhere, I believe. And I don't know how to make her spawn. I know it's not from a side quest. I've done all the side quests in the game and I never had to deal with her. And everything's dead. So the question is, now what? I mean, enemies are still spawning, so something's happening. Well, that was a fun, needless, need, not needed murder spree. Nothing. I don't know how to. I guess I'll look that up and try it again next stream. I just wanted to kill her because she gives a lot of experience. But oh well, we wasted enough time here. Now, it's time to start a clan war. Is it really a good idea to do this now, though? I'm trying to. I'm thinking of the rewards we could get. And I don't see any of them being useful to me. No. After thinking about it a little bit more, I don't think I am going to be doing this because this is really, really long. And I have none of the rewards that I are I'm able to get from them are any good for me because I'm going melee. If I wasn't melee, then a few of them might have been more useful. Hey, can you run me over? Hey, dipshit. Run me over. No. Thanks, asshole. You just came by, killed me, and ran away. I'm all the way back here. Depression. So yeah, we're going to do House of Caverns, uh, do those three missions, House of Caverns, grab their experience, and hopefully by that time we should be level 22 and be ready to take on the wildlife pre preservation. Look at those assholes out there. I'm going to kill you because you assholes are assets. No, they're driving away. I'm going to kill this buzzard instead. Make me feel better. 
All right, let's go find ourselves a save. Hey now, you're going to die now because y'all wanted to show up over here. Don't think you're going to get away from me that easily. Explode! Yay. That's not where I want to go. I want to go here. Because here is where I want to be. Not over there. Not over yonder. But here. Because here, I could go over there. And by being over there... I can make it come here. And by being here, my objectives get complete. I was trying to make it do like that weird thing where you like rhyme the words and you just go in a circle. Don't know what I'm talking about, neither do I. I like how they rebuilt the bridge just so we could get back over here. Welcome to Sanctuary Hole! What are we gonna do here? We are gonna mass murder everybody! I think my organs are liquefied! No, he dropped it! Look at this, all this raw melee damage. And we even have AoE now too when we melee, which could be nice. I'm gonna die. Fuck you, suicider. Alright, so we don't need to be up here anymore. I don't care about that with no objective. Instead, we're just gonna jump down here. Wee! land on here and go to the Costa Caverns let's hang out at the Costa Caverns do these easy three missions and then we'll finally be done with the great journey of missions that we get after we come back to Sanctuary the second time give me that give me that what do I get I get bonuses to this, yes. Damn, that's a lot of cooldown. A lot of cooldown reduction and a lot of friendly fire bonus damage got reduced as well. Nice. Nice! Uh, don't want any of this. I don't, ooh, 5%. Is that the max I could get this early? Damn, that's nice. That's a nice drop. Give me that. I don't need this extra 6% of melee damage. I have hundreds of melee damage increases already. Alright, let's go find that safe. What else we got? Um, we're going to be following... Ooh, we're going to be following this quest because I don't know exactly where these things are at. And I already know where the safe is at. Get out of here. <clears throat> oh, these bar kids are getting punished. Oh, these poor bar kids, they are getting punished. Ever seen a person before? Oh, not now. Here, 
No! I want to be corroded. What? No! You screwed me, you stupid chrysalis! Now we gotta run all the way back because of the damn chrysalis. <sighs> Melee in Borderlands. Extremely fun, but can be extremely difficult at times. I really didn't want to go back and play in the first Borderlands. Uh, I need to really get that for the PS3. <laughs> Uh, I actually don't want to fight you anymore. You guys are being mean. You guys are being rough. I just wanted to play a friendly game. And now I'm already almost halfway dead. Slice your eyelids so you can watch the end. No! I thought I could get away with it. Oh, that's what I get for thinking. Alright, we'll switch to this instead. Because with explosion damage, you don't need to hit their crystals, you can just hit them in your face. And it'd be done. Alright, so here's the safe. And I wonder what this is going to be. It's blue! Oh, it's actually blue! A badass chrysalis. You found this safe? Oh, thank God! And there's the pictures. We were all this entire time, we were just looking for pictures of Moxie. Uh, anything? Did he drop anything? Does not look like it. Unless it got sent out all the way out there. That's money. Money, money. Don't want that chest. I don't think he dropped anything. Does he drop it? I, I'm pretty sure he does have a legendary drop, but I just don't know what it is. I usually never, I never hear anyone talk about it, so it's probably not any good. But more chrysalis means more rockets. Oh, chrysalis. Ooh, we got Threshers, everybody. Got Threshers. We're just going to ignore the Threshers, though, because there's no reason for us. You know what? I'm going to kill you, because you could be an asshole. Yup, the wormholes being an asshole, like always. Oh, multiple wormholes. Beautiful. I just wanted to kill y'all easily for some extra health, but I guess now we're in, now we're in war. Our kid.
know what would happen? Mrs. Hartchick, I don't think you understand. You can't mine <laughs> these creatures. They're living beings. Without the crystals, they'll die. Sanctuary could easily find another dig site. My security team and I are not hunting these creatures for you. Period. Security officer Booth. You, you Vark kids want to fight? Miss Booth, need I remind you of the terms of your contract? You the cool thing about the shield too, the level thumper, is that if you take damage, the shield will reset its recharge time. Whether or not you agree with my policies is irrelevant. So I'm pretty much have zero shield. Uh, like at all times while in the middle of a fight which is pretty useful for melee at least for Krieg and Zero because they have a lot of abilities that don't require shields so not a bad shield it is I believe it's considered to be one of the best there are better void shields than this um like the height of Terramorphous I believe is better well, damage-wise, you get more void damage than the uh, void damage you get from this shield. Um, I believe there was another one too. What's there's another void shield, I believe. Oh, I forgot the name of it, but it's also I believe it's a quest reward too. That's also pretty good. Threshers, get. Out of here. Don't you whip me. Oh, that's like. No, the barrel. No, to strike your face from my fingernails. Stop it. Stop it. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get! Get from my domain! Get! Uh, I don't want the mine card. I want... I want perfectly peaceful. Oh, I know where the last one's at. Yeah, we're not going to be getting the last one for a long while. Yeah. Not a long while, but we have to do this other mission first. Uh, tadpole and tadpole. We're gonna ignore them for now. We're just gonna we're gonna bully this chrysalis. And up until the point I'm out of ammo. Cool thing about chrysalis is that you always get critical hits on them no matter what, if you wanna damage them. Unless you have splash damage. So sniper rifles, anything with critical hit bonuses are pretty good against these guys. I'm gonna hit you no to get my health back. There's no fence on this fence. This is why I love you, Krieg. No, she's dead. Because she wasn't paying attention. You don't have all the guns, dear. Now, unless anyone from the late Miss Booth's security team has anything else to say, bring me my goddamned crystals! More crystals! I mean, now they're, at least they're enemies now, so we don't have to worry about them too much. Get out of here. And give me these crystals.
Ooh, I forgot I had this. <laughs> I always forget I have grenades because I never use grenades in this game. Only magic missile and sometimes chain lightning on my Gunzerker if I need a quick heal. Antique piece of doll machinery. If you were gazing slack jawed at your feet when Sanctuary flew into the air, mm. you might not know the Doll Corporation held a great interest in Pandora's resources once upon a time. Push! It's time for us to push a minecart, but before we do that, let's get the Easter egg first. You thought I was going to leave without the Easter egg? Nah. There's always, I always want the chance to get the two badass uh, legendary weapons from these guys. I'm in, but I still gotta mine through some more stuff. I'm here! It's a creeper! We automatically started playing Minecraft. No, me. And I don't know why they gave me a skin for the Macromancer. Macromancer is by far one of my least favorite classes to play in the game. I do not like it. Now, I would not recommend mailing a creeper because they explode upon death. And yeah. You don't want any of that. And after a while, you'll get a badass creeper which has a chance to drop two legendary weapons, which is uh, only available from these creepers. Sadly, all I got was a Macromancer head. Everything for Macromancer has got nothing for the Psycho. How sad indeed. And once the badass comes out, then we're done. Are the two legendary weapons from the Super Badass any good? Um, they're not bad, they're not the best, but they're fun gimmick weapons that are not like super hardcore gimmicky that make them bad. I, I think they're pretty decent weapons, I enjoyed using them when I got them on my Gunzerker. Now PUSH! Somebody delivered a feast! A badass war kid, you transform randomly. Get out of here. Don't you dare hit me. Alright, time to push. After I pick up the self. All right, now we push. After I grab all the crystals. All right, no more, no more joking around. Oh, never mind. We got a damn crystals here. And I'm out of grenades. What the hell is hitting me so hard? It's this asshole. No! I knew he was gonna kill me, that's why I didn't waste my bus saw. Uh, I got a problem. Damn it! No, Psycho, I'm sorry. The lack of ammunition is what drove me into this mess. And I have to run all the way back to move that cart. Damn playable characters that have no defense skills. Do you have any defense skills other than overkill? Not on this tree. What about this tree? I don't think this tree has any defensive skills either. I believe your only defensive skills are this one and this one. I might just put points into that just to get my health back in times like that. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know if it's any useful, though. I don't know how much overkill damage I'm actually doing. I mean, maybe, maybe in later playthroughs. I mean, I get all my defensive healing capabilities in Buzzsaw, but I haven't, I haven't increased that yet. I mean, once I get the power to increase the length of my butt saw rampage and 
get it to heal me when I proc it at 33% life, which is what we really need. And then we'll be in business. Then we are going to have some hardcore capabilities. And I'm going to kill you for vengeance. Even though it wasn't you that killed me, you attempted to kill me. It also doesn't help that not having a shield is causing me a lot of problems too, but that's just the way it works. And vengeance. Sledge's shotgun. I will never forget I have you again unless I do. Alright, now with all the interruptions and death out of the way, let's finish pushing this minecart. Or at least get it to the first checkpoint. Are you kidding me? There's still a Thresher here? Get out of here! Get out of here! Get out of here! I could push a minecart and reload a shotgun at the same time. And yes, to push the minecart, you have to run into it. Yes, I know. Weird, but that's just how we have to do it. Get! 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 How did that break y'all though? See that's the thing I don't get is how they actually went crazy. Oh well now that's gone so I can do this now. AoE melee damage! Damn that's a lot of adults. Why are all of you turning to adults? That's not fair. I wasn't even on the inside when you all decided to turn to adults. Look at that, there were five adults. <coughs> and now it's time to push. Yay, and with the third airlock fully opened, we could finish this mission. Oh, no, I have to keep pushing it. What am I doing? How could I finish the mission if I'm not done pushing? I didn't realize my law has a shitty doll scope. And now we just wait until it gets crushed in the crusher. Hey, can you hit me real quick? Thank you. I don't want my shields coming back. So if you're looking at the minimap and have no idea how to fill in this black spot on the minimap, do not worry, we cannot fill in that black spot on the minimap in the top right corner just yet. We'll have to wait till later, because we have to get a certain side quest to get to the area that we need to get to, to turn on that black spot into map. You know, not to stifle your menial victories with deep and light thought, what must assume a deeper connection between the demon spewing vault and the limitless iridium in this planet? Perhaps someday I will uncover the 
these secrets and further down the line invent a dance based around sneezing. Ow. You need to not do that, mister. That's rude of you. I do not appreciate it. I do not appreciate that kind of backsass. Uh, don't really need that, and all this is just self honor. Okay, so that quest we did didn't seem like it was worth it, but it was actually required to do if you wanted to get into this building, because in this building is the last piece of echo we need. It's in this little uh, locker room over here. And once you're in this building, you can actually open up the areas to lead outside. So, that quest is very important if you want to fully explore or do everything in Caustic Caverns. You cannot skip that minecart, you have to do it if you want to do Caustic Caverns. Now, is there anything interesting in Caustic Caverns? Not really. I'm just doing these quests for, uh... Pretty much just for experience at this point. Um, really the only thing of interest here would probably be blue, because I believe he does have a legendary. And, uh, the quest involving blue. Because the quest involving blue actually gives you a pretty useful shotgun. Oh, please. Thank God none of them decided to finish me off. So yeah, the only thing interesting here in Cosmic Caverns would be the blue quest. Everything else in Cosmic Caverns could go... Could be skipped. It's not that important. You get nothing really interesting here. Uh, this could be a good place to summon Vermid, to summon a, a raid boss. But we'll get into that later because we can't summon the raid boss here until uh, True Vault Hunter mode or Ultimate Vault Hunter mode or the overpowered levels. But welcome back to the outside. And we're done here. This is pretty much the entirety of Cosmic Caverns. Um, that all we could do now. I could go to that side and explore over there. But there's nothing interesting over there. So back to Sanctuary we go. And that's pretty much all the side quests I plan on doing from this set. Um, not really too many of them are particularly interesting. I think Slaughterhouse is a pretty interesting one to do, but you have to do It's a long side quest. And it's actually pretty difficult at times, too, if you die a lot. Um, all the safe and sound is important because it gives you a good shotgun. I do not recommend the Relic at all. Clan War is a very good one. You get a lot of good rewards at the end. So I would recommend you do the Clan War all the way up to the end. Because you could get two legendaries, two good, uh, one good quest reward if you choose the SMG and not the shotgun. And yeah, this is the, the clan, the clan war is actually a cool, cool quest too in my mind. I enjoy it a lot, but it's really long, and I don't really want to push my way through it right now. I just want to uh, finish up these quick and easy ones, grab the experience, and push the story. Because I would like to get the true Vault Hunter mode, and Ultimate Vault, Hunt, uh, Vault Hunter mode, or at least higher levels so we can start getting into the fun skills. So if you turn the pictures in the Moxie, she'll give you uh, part of the Heartbreaker, which is an extremely good, which is an extremely good um, Hyperion shotgun, better than the Sledge's shotgun by miles, because it's pretty much the first Moxie gun you could get, 
And Moxie guns have a chance to heal you with the damage you do while holding the gun. Not a chance, but they do heal you by the damage you do. I believe this shotgun has like 2 or 3% health back, but that's still pretty good. And it's just really good. And you know, because I can't leave him out, we are going to go do Claptrap's birthday bash. Actually, I don't want to do your birthday bash, slap trap. No, I'll get it out of the way. Because I don't think I could do anything else with him later unless I do this quest. So yeah, we'll get it out of the way, just in case. So, Claptrap's birthday bash is an extremely easy mission. But it might make it might make you sad on the inside. Depends on how much you like left trap. God, this is a uh, good weapon. It's a good weapon, but I think you get this weapon at the bat at a bad time. This is an extremely good weapon for a Krieg if you're going down the Hellborn tree, because it's always gonna be fire no matter what. And you could use this. this is a good weapon to get your um to set yourself on fire pretty quickly so it's a really good weapon on Krieg if you're going Hellborn this is probably the best chance you'll get to go Hellborn this early in the game because here you are gonna have uh, you should have some decent elemental guns by now and you'll get you'll be going into flame flare and you're almost to elemental empathy which will keep you alive while you're on fire if you're doing elemental damage to enemies which if you're in hellborn you should be doing a hundred percent elemental damage so you can keep yourself alive and yes this dead body's gonna be here forever so yay for dead bodies But we're not doing Hellborn just yet. We're going down the melee tree. I'll probably try out Hellborn for Ultimate Vault Hunters mode at level 50 because that's when we'll have like a bunch of useful skills together. And now we wait here for two minutes and five seconds and party with Claptrap! Woo! Actually, I don't even think this quest was that important because you could probably do all the missions while this quest is still active. Because I, I do watch a lot of speedrunners. Or a lot of people play this game. Some of them are speedrunners. And they always skip this quest. But you know what? We're going to do it because it's Claptrap. I actually like Claptrap. I think he's a good character. I enjoy him in all the games except the pre-sequel because he is probably one of the worst characters to play in the pre-sequel because of how random his uh, action skill is. Could be very good at times, but at the same time it could be very bad. Yay, party with Claptrap. Claptrap, you know you're partying with a cycle, right? So... Don't just think you could just walk away and let this play out. Because Claptrap is going to make you uh, do objectives before he resumes the timer. And I like how the invitations are actually stuck in midair. Like, I never took them. Which is, uh, makes sense because no one's going to show up anyway. I'm going to look at these invitations, dude. The world's greatest game. Well-coded game. Oh, but looks like we're losing frames. So we're probably going to end the stream here in a little bit. Because my catch card probably can't handle anymore for now. I don't know why. It's probably because the capture card's overheating. The capture card's a piece of shit. I know that. Hell yeah, I can. Yay! Clash Trap, we're having fun. I'm having fun. There's no way to end a stream without having Clash Trap's birthday bash. I mean, that's the way to end a stream. 
stream is almost done in 20 seconds. So. No problem, buddy. I'm your friend. Woo! Because I was here and I'm your best friend. Flat Trout's my best friend. All right, so I, I'm seeing that we're have character cards having some problems right now, so we're gonna end the stream here for now. I don't want to start this next mission and have the character card give out in the middle of it because it's a pretty long mission and an important mission. So thank you guys for watching on YouTube. If you did, leave a like if you enjoyed the video and enjoy the crazy cycle life that I'm living and. Make sure you subscribe to my Twitch or my YouTube if you want to continue. Watch me destroy the world with a buzzsaw or setting myself on fire. Because it's a lot of fun. So thank you guys for watching. Yada, yada, yada. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.